everyone, Jonathan Taylor here with the BIB Podcast, bringing you another video tip this week. Today we're going to cover another tip on VideoScribe and specifically on how to use the morphing feature, something that uh, VideoScribe has recently added. Um, had some questions on uh, that were sent to me on how to uh, how to use that morphing feature, and it's very simple to use. So if I take uh, just to give you an example, of what that looks like. If I go over here and uh, click on, uh, we'll start from one of these slides here, and we'll just click the play button. And you can see the little arrow morphs into a hand. So it's very easy to do if you want to do that. So the way you do that is uh, I'm going to select a slide uh, that I want to have morphed. And I'm going to click on uh, this guy down here that has the frustrated look. And if I'm using, if you're using a Mac, uh, that's going to be the option and then click. Uh, if you're using a PC, just be right, uh, right click. And you're going to see here, you're given the option of uh, the morphing feature. And I'm going to click on that. The next thing it's going to ask me is, what do you want to morph from? Uh, and it's going to give you, it's always going to give you the previous, some previous slides that you're morphing from. And I'm going to take uh, the previous slide, the one that comes right before that, which is the arrow. I'm going to select that and then click on the arrow. So if I do that, uh, it's very simple. Uh, if we click on, I'm going to click on the slide right before the arrow just to give us a little uh, buffer there. And then you're going to see the arrow. It's going to merge. It's going to slowly morph. Now that's a little slow for me. So what I want to do is I'm going to go in and I'm actually going to adjust the speed on that. So I'm going to click back on the slide and I'm going to come here. And just like you're adjusting the speed on the drawing, you can adjust the speed on the, uh, on, on the morphing too. So I do it the same way that you do the drawing. It's already set to morph. So I'm just going to add that, make that one second. And I'm going to come back over here and let's see, let's, let's re let's try that again. And so you're going to see the arrow is going to be a lot faster because I've reduced that from five seconds down to uh, one second. So, that's how you, uh, that's how you uh, add the morphing feature on any slides that you're drawing or adding into it. Just simply click on that and, um, and select the morphing feature. And then you can adjust, just like the drawing, you can adjust the, uh, the time that it takes to morph. Um, pretty cool feature, uh, something new that uh, Sparkle's added into VideoScribe. And it really does help to uh, enhance your animations or your drawing uh, videos if you're putting together a presentation. That's all. And if you have any questions, you can reach me over at info at bibpodcast.com. You can also find other uh, video tips like this over at uh, bibpodcast.com. You can also subscribe to our podcast. Thanks again. Have a great week and God bless.